win in the shutout, how did that feel? I just was really proud of the effort in front of me, you know, starting off the game with a couple of huge uh, kills and, um, you know, boys just played so hard and, you know, obviously they're an amazing team over there. They're not going to be thrilled about the game one, but that's what it is. It's game one of the series and uh, we really like the way we played, but we got to refocus here. What does that do for your night, Jack, when the guys kill off the and then you see what they're doing when you puck battles and that sort of thing and your confidence or whatever for the rest of them? Yeah, I think it's just uh, infectious on each other. You see a guy sacrifice his body, block a shot, or just make a great defensive play and break up, uh, you know, their dangerous power play, and you know, uh, makes you want to do your job even more. So um, I think it was just kind of we were just rolling off of each other tonight, just trying to do the best we could for each other, and it paid off. How you describe Mitch's performance tonight? He was dialed in. You know. I th- I think we could talk about everybody on the team, and he'd be the first one to do that. But he he looked uh, he looked amazing. So we gotta have him keep her going. Coming back against back-to-back champs, they've been rolling down the stretch uh, with the history of your group from last year. What kind of a statement do you think this sends to the league? Well, we're just focused on our group. You know, obviously they're the back-to-back champs, and they've been in positions before. So. You know, it's just one game. We, we really like the way we played, but we got to uh, get back at it tomorrow in practice, have a good day, and um, it's all we're focused on right now. Is that one of those rare wins where you can go look up and down your entire roster and say, this guy contributed, that guy contributed? Like, you can go about 18 deep tonight. Yeah, I think that was kind of the story of the, the regular season with the success we had. Obviously, there's moments throughout the year somebody stepped up for us, but um, we had, you know, full team efforts so many times this year, and it was no different tonight. Just uh, really thrilled with the way everybody played. As a friend of Mitch's and knowing he was held off the scoreboard last playoffs, how did, how did you feel when he got one? I knew it was just a matter of time. I mean, he, he wants it so bad, to, you know. He's such an elite player, and um, obviously this is the most fun time of the year, and it's most intense, and just really happy for him because he's put in so much hard work, and he's done so well for our team. Um, you know, since I've been here, it's, it's just been fun to watch him grow, and, you know, it's a great step in, in a pretty amazing direction. What was going through your mind when all the, all those fights were happening at the end there around you uh, and a couple of guys you usually don't fight? Yeah, I mean, it's just part of the hockey, and... Um, you know, guys are going at it, competitive, and um, yeah, that's about it. The most important question, Jack, what did you eat last night? What did you watch? <laughs> oh, my girlfriend Ashley cooked me a nice chicken breast, actually, and um, I've been watching the Ozark, the new season, so it was a nice, relaxing e- evening with the cats. Yeah, I switched it up. Thanks, Thank you, guys. Thank you.